we are going to do question number 5 of exercise 14.5. Now let's read the question. With PQ of length 6.1 cm as diameter, draw a circle. That means we have to draw a circle whose diameter is 6.1 cm. Now to draw a circle, we need to know the radius of that circle. That means the half of the diameter will be the radius. So first of all, let's draw the line what is given. So we can write it on the side that PQ is equal to 6.1 centimeter. Fine. Now to draw a line we need a ruler. Let's take the ruler. Okay. Now we are going to draw a line of 6.1 centimeter from 0 we will start and draw the line. Fine. Remove the ruler as it's in the question is already saying it's PQ. So it's don't forget to mark PQ. So one end is P and the other one is Q. Now to get a middle, the center of the circle, this is a diameter. The diameter always passes through the center of the circle and it is in the center. To find the center of this line segment, we need to bisect it. And in earlier questions, we have already studied how to bisect a line. So what we need is a protector. Now what we will do is we will place the needle of a protector at one end of the line Fine. And then we are going to drag a little bit bigger than the line. You can see it's approximately, you can lock the compass and then you can actually make an arc. Okay, so let's make an arc. Now, same way on the other side of the line. Let's just draw it on the other side of the line. Right? Now, we'll place the needle of the compass on the other end. Right? And we'll again mark the arc which is going to cut the arcs which we have drawn earlier. Okay. Let's remove the compass. Now you can see one point is here and one point we are getting it here where the two arcs are cutting each other. Now once we have got the two points, what we are supposed to do? Draw the line. So from here, join these two points. Okay. Now this is the one which is bisecting PQ. Okay. This is the bisector. We can mark it as, for example, we can mark it as A. B, okay, so let's mark it, the inset intersecting points, so this is A and this is B and on the side we can even write it down, AB, this is the bisector,
of CQ. Okay. And let's mark the uh, point where they, it is bisecting as O over here. So this is going to be the center of the circle. Now once we have got the center of the circle, now we can make a rate. This is the radius OP or OQ. This is the radius of the circle. Now with a compass, we just need to measure. Keep it what one side, unlock it. Okay. Now just drag it to the center. You got it? Okay. Just lock it and put this needle in the center and draw the circle. Okay, you place the needle at the center. Drag your pencil to the one end. Okay, once you are done, lock it. Okay, and then just draw the circle. Okay. Can you see that? Now PQ is a diameter. Fine. O is the center. So you can write it down on the side also. PQ is diameter diameter O is the center So we are done with the question number five. This is what it was asking us. It, it gave us the length of the diameter and it was asking us to draw a circle. That's it.